Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, uh, I know I'm looking rough. I feel like my eyebrows are wonky. I have no foundation on. <sighs> Just looking a hot mess. So, I have officially found a roommate. Thank goodness. Um, it means we can stay where we live. Uh, so that is a positive. Um, however, uh, if you guys have watched a previous video, I was explaining that I had to give up my makeup room, which it sucks, but it's necessary. Um, so I'm in my room. <laughs> uh, it has been a journey, uh, going through everything, decluttering, getting rid of stuff, and downsizing. Uh, I haven't figured out where exactly I want to record. I'm kind of like here in my corner of my bedroom. Um, I thought about maybe like setting up in the bathroom. I don't have that much room in the bathroom. I'd have to like assemble and take it down each time. Um, we'll see. I think I'll just try a couple different places and when I go to edit uh, the video, we'll see what looks best. So this is definitely my first rough draft. <laughs> but that is okay because I don't hide anything from you guys. This is the real me. This is what's going on. This is my life and I love sharing that with you. So with that being said, it's Ipsy glam bag time. I'm so excited. Um, this has like a cute little peach on it which is so cute. Uh, and then of course the bag is blue and white. And the first item. Let's go ahead. This is from Scone. This is a Luxe lip liner. Uh, I don't really use lip liners. I kind of want to try them. Uh, I feel like I could overline my lips a little bit better. So we'll see. Uh, and this is in the shade Cosmo, which look, looks like a nude color. And it actually looks like it would really go with the one I'm wearing right now. Sorry, I was looking over here because I, I have a mirror over here. My, like I said, my setup is off. Uh, but this is a full-size lip liner. So, not a bad start for my Ipsy Glam Bag. The next item is uh, the Big Ego uh, Mascara from Tarte. I want to say that I've gotten this before, but I don't think I ever tried it. Um, it's interesting because I, I love testing out new mascaras. I actually just tested out a new one right before I filmed. That's what I'm wearing. Um, it's like a makeup revolution. It was their Batman mascara. I'm a big Batman fan. Uh, and I hate it. <laughs> uh, the mascara does absolutely nothing for my eyelashes whatsoever. Um, so I will not continue using that. So, uh, I am actually excited to try this. I, like I said, I don't know if I tried the first one that I got, if I did get it. Uh, but it, even so, I don't know where it is. So, I'm happy that's in here. The next item is mm, from Neogen Dermatology. This is a V Biome Advanced Eye Cream. Very nice. It's a little nice size. I mean, because for eye cream, you only need a tad bit anyway, just to kind of like tap around your eye area. Uh, this says. It helps hydrate and firm the saggy and wrinkle-prone areas around the eyes. Thank you so much, Ipsy. It's exactly what I need. Um, now that I have officially hit 40 years old, I am noticing a lot of difference. A lot of difference in my skin. And uh, skin care has become extremely important. And it's always been important, but like extremely important. Uh, in my life, so I'm happy that this is in here. Another item we have, ooh, this is from Byro, New York. Mm -hmm. It says it's a Pro Berry Pore Refining Toner. Very nice. That's actually a really nice size sample right there. Um, because toners, once again, just like eye creams, a little bit goes a long way. You don't have to like douse your face in this. Um, also, I'll have to do some research on this and see what it targets. Well, I mean, obviously it targets pores, but there's any other benefits. Uh, and this is vegan, by the way. And then the very last item is from Chicago Beauty. I don't think I've ever heard of them. 
This is the Chica Beauty Fiesta Mini Eyeshadow Palette. Very nice. I love eyeshadow palettes. They're like my number one love. Uh, if you have not been with me for a long time, just in case you wanted to know. So this is the packaging right here and it has the shades on the back. It actually gives you the shade names. This is also vegan, cruelty free. And it says clean ingredients and it's from, it's recycled or recyclable. Okay, so this is what the palette looks like. I think it's actually really pretty. I love this pop of purple and pop of green and then you have a black shimmer right here. Or it's like a blackish blue shimmer. Really, really pretty. So these four are your mattes, which makes a perfect, complete eye look. Um, and then you have your shimmers. Oh, I'm sorry, this one is matte too. Cool. Um, yeah, you can definitely make a complete look with this palette. It's really, really pretty. I like that. I like that a lot. Oh, but with me downsizing to my room, I have to realize I think I already have shades this color, more than likely for sure, in my collection. So if I just kept it, it would be a disservice. So I'm going to put this in a future giveaway. Um, and speaking of giveaways, if you guys have not entered, I do have a giveaway going on right now. I will have that linked down below. So make sure you guys enter because I know, um, I think it's supposed to be ending soon. So yes. Okay, so really quickly, let's go over um, everything. We got the eyeshadow palette, which is really, really, really pretty. We have the full size lip liner, the mascara, the toner and the eye cream. So all in all, I think this is a really nice bag for the month of April and I cannot wait to see what I get for the month of May. So that is it. Thank you guys for like hanging in there with me <laughs> uh, as I get everything together. But um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.